Turkish FNSS, through its official Twitter account, on July 18, 2023, highlighted the key moments of a large-scale firepower exercise that took place in Jemmas, Malaysia, showcasing the impressive performance of the AV-8 Jempita armored vehicles. These vehicles demonstrated remarkable agility and adaptability on various terrains. The exercise was held under the patronage of the King of Malaysia, Sultan Abdullah Shah. Malaysia recently organized this military exercise to demonstrate its defense capabilities, and its ability to address regional security challenges in a geostrategic context marked by growing tensions in Southeast Asia. The exercise aimed to prepare the Malaysian armed forces to face potential threats and defend national interests, especially concerning territorial claims in the South China Sea and the protection of maritime resources. Moreover, it provided an opportunity for Malaysia to cooperate with ASEAN partners and other regional allies to strengthen stability and security in the Southeast Asian region. Malaysia reaffirmed its commitment to diplomacy, regional cooperation, and seeking peaceful solutions to geopolitical tensions by participating in this military exercise. The exercise showcased cutting-edge military equipment, including the AV-8 Jempita armored vehicles, the 120mm Akinci cannons, and the Adnan armored combat vehicles, all manufactured by the prestigious defense company FNSS, Firet Makina VE Savunma Sanei A.S. and specially exported to Malaysia. AV-8 Jempita The AV-8 Jempita is the latest generation of 8x8 armored personnel carriers for the Malaysian armed forces. The DEFTEC AV-8 is a new generation of wheeled armored vehicles, focusing on mobility, protection, payload, and potential for development. The latest designs and technologies from commercial automotive industries have been militarized to meet modern military operations, performance and durability requirements. In June 2011, the Turkish company FNSS signed a letter of offer and acceptance with DRB Hikam Defense Technologies, DEFTEC, to design, develop, and manufacture these vehicles. The selected AV-8 vehicle for the Malaysian Army is based on the versatile 8x8 armored vehicle PARS, designed by FNSS. The contract includes technology transfer arrangements to DEFTEC and logistical support for the Malaysian Army making this vehicle and its 12 variants Malaysia's first indigenous family of 8x8 armored vehicles. Akinci ZHA 120mm mortar carrier. The tracked armored combat vehicle ACV-19, developed and manufactured by FNSS Savunma Systemary, is a family of 15 to 19 ton class vehicles derived from the successful ACV-15 of FNSS. The ACV-19 offers performance improvements and compatibility with the ACV-15 family. Furthermore, it has been adopted by the Malaysian Army as a 120mm mortar carrier. The ACV-19 family also includes a tracked logistics carrier, TLC, which has a crew compartment at the front with the driver on the left and the power pack on the right. At the rear, a flatbed with attachment points can be quickly modified with removable sides and a rear door. The TLC can carry up to 6 tons of payload and is equipped with a HIAB-182R hydraulic crane on its roof enabling the loading and unloading of material up to a range of 3.3 meters, with a lifting capacity of 1.6 tons remotely up to 1 meter. ZMA-15 The ZMA-15 is an improved version of the tracked armored combat vehicle ACV-15, developed and manufactured by FNSS Savunma Systemary. It retains the overall design of the ACV-15 but is equipped with the new Nefer turret of 25mm, manufactured by Aselson, a Turkish company specialized in defense electronic systems. The ZMA-15 uses the same track chassis and hull as the ACV-15 but features improved armor, splash suppression systems, and warning receivers, enhancing its protection and resilience on the battlefield. The remotely controlled Nefer turret is armed with a 25mm M242 automatic cannon, and a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun, providing increased firepower. With on-the-move firing capabilities against stationary or moving targets, improved electronic vision, and level 2 Stanag 4569 ballistic protection, the ZMA-15 represents an enhanced and high-performance version of the original ACV-15 vehicle. The exercise not only demonstrated the military capabilities of Malaysia, but also showcased the advanced technologies and expertise of FNSS in producing state-of-the-art defense equipment. 
This cooperation between FNSS and Malaysia in strengthening their defense capabilities highlights the significance of regional security and stability in the context of geopolitical tensions in Southeast Asia.